Okay, Mandy, so here's the deal. Okay. Everyone always wants you to tell the 72 cookie story, and I know you hate having to tell this story. Yeah, because I told it like a million billion times, and people still forgot about it, and they still ask for it, and I'm tired of it. So if we make a video on it, this will be the last time you ever have to tell this story. What do you say? I'm in. Okay. So long before I became YouTube famous. <laughs> well. I was YouTube famous, okay? Give me this. I was going to complain because you were YouTube famous at the time. Well... So, anyway, I'm in my 20-somethings. I'm working at Subway. It's a band-aid job. I don't really know what I'm doing with my life at this point. You know what you're doing with your life at this point? Listen, I'm a little closer to than I was before, okay? So, I was working at Subway because that's what YouTube artists tend to do all the time is they work at Subway. Right, Odd Ones Out? And we have this event called Free Cookie Friday where you get a sandwich and you get a free cookie with it. It's one cookie per sandwich. Are you explaining to our audience what Free Cookie Friday is. Listen, a lot of the customers needed explanations on what Free Cookie Friday was, so I have to explain to these people too. Like the people who would come in and ask for a free cookie, and if they could have a free cookie along with their free cookie? Yes. I mean, if we're gonna follow that logic, then they can just take every fucking cookie in the store. But that ain't how it works, okay? That's not how Subway do it. So, I'm working at Subway. It's Free Cookie Friday. I made about six dozen cookies in the morning, just to make sure we were clear for the lunch rush and everything would be fine. I'd probably be making more in the afternoon but that's beside the point. So I tend to make about six dozen cookies in the morning, uh, about, you know, one of each flavor, just so everybody's satisfied, everybody gets their fucking free cookie and they get out. And I managed to do this, and here comes the lunch rush, it's Friday, there's like 30 people in line, and this man walks up to me, and he says, hi, can I have six dozen cookies, please? So I'm just sitting there galaxy braining, trying to figure out the math, because I made six dozen cookies this morning, and he wants six dozen for himself. And I said, no, sir. I don't think we can do that right now. I only made six dozen this morning and several people have already taken some already. And he was like, I don't understand. Why can't I have these six dozen cookies? These 72 chocolate chip cookies. Specifically chocolate chip cookies. Yes, he wanted 72 chocolate chip cookies. And now, you made six dozen cookies in the morning. But it was a variety. How many varieties did Subway do of cookies at the time? Five, I think. It was like chocolate chip, raspberry, macadamia nut, peanut butter and oatmeal rum and raisin. raisin oatmeal raisin you fucking rum weirdo and raisin. but there's no rum and raisin cookie what the fuck is wrong with you so i say sir i only made six dozen cookies this morning and they weren't all chocolate chip now if you hang out for about 20 minutes i can bake you some fresh ones and then i can send you on your way and it'll all be gucci it'll be fine and this man was like i don't understand why don't you have six dozen chocolate chip cookies and i was like because it's not a fucking bakery but i didn't say that instead i said sir i can make those for you but you're gonna have to wait because there's still frozen. And he says, this is unacceptable. I don't understand why you can't give me six dozen fucking chocolate chip cookies. You have ruined my son's birthday party. And I was like, oh, oh God. Shit's getting real now. And out from behind him peeks a small boy. Uh, not even like really out behind him peeks a small boy. He's off in the fucking corner trying not to get noticed. Like this poor kid is over there embarrassed to death by his father who's yelling at a girl working at Subway that she doesn't have six dozen chocolate chip cookies. I mean, I would be pretty embarrassed by that. Gotta be honest. So this man continues to escalate. He tells me, and I shit you not, that he's gonna write me to corporate. He's gonna get me fired. He's gonna tell my manager and I will never work in this town again. Again. Funny thing is, later down the line, he was totally right. I never worked in that town again, and my manager did wind up firing me. For that occasion, actually. Yes, it was an excuse, though. It really, really shouldn't have been because of him. You were fired because you didn't have 72 cookies prepped. God, how dare I? How dare I not have six dozen chocolate chip cookies at the ready at Subway? Not even, I can't give you six dozen cookies, but you'll have to wait 20 minutes for them to bake. Right? Like, I would have gladly given him his order. I would have. I just didn't, didn't have him ready to materialize out of nowhere. Just poof, here's your chocolate chip cookies, sir. Okay, you all have your 72 cookies story now. You can stop asking. Thank you for clicking on the link because I will have referred you to this.